not your country, you shouldn't be there. Is that something they teach you at school or, or no, not really? I don't think it would affect me if the Falklands returned to Argentina. ¿Cuántos saben y qué opinan los británicos sobre las Islas Malvinas? Hace dos años hice un video similar y vamos a hacerlo de nuevo. ¿Qué opinan? ¿Qué saben? ¿Qué creen los británicos sobre las Islas Malvinas? Recuerdo siempre que este tipo de videos no es representativo. Nos puede tocar la persona que más sabe, así como también la persona que menos sabe. Pero siempre está bueno hacer un paneo general. Voy a hacer dos videos este año sobre Malvinas. Uno sobre la exhibición que hay en este museo, que es el Museo de Guerra, y otro que es este, hablando con la gente. Sin más preámbulos, al video. So, um, what do you know about the Falklands? Uh, the islands. Uh -huh. Do you know where they are? Somewhere in the sea. No, I'm not confident enough to say. Do you know about the war, the Falklands war? Limited knowledge. Limited knowledge. Yeah. What, for example? Oh, not enough to give any particular description. Do you know, for example, who it was against or...? Spanish. What do you know about the Falklands? Uh, well, I was alive at the time. There was no way I believed that um, when the Argentinians took over, the British were going to allow it to happen. That's not the way mm -hmm. we operate. I'm sure the Ar uh, Argentina has got um, reasons why they believe it belongs to them. So, but as I said, the way it was done, uh, there was no way the British, certainly at that time, well, were going to let it go. What do you know about the Falkland Islands? All I know about the Falkland Islands is the war, when we went to war over there, with have been seen on it. Yeah. Lives were lost on it on both sides. You listen to all what everybody says, you read the papers, you watch the television and you form opinion in your mind on where, what was right and wrong. There are a set of islands in the South Atlantic uh, that were a British possession from about 1821, I think. And uh, the Argentinians invaded and Mrs Thatcher sent a task force down and, uh, and they, they, they were defeated. I remember the debate in the House of Commons. The press was uh, pretty gung ho in favour of sending the task force. Es interesante ver cómo va cambiando con la edad, ¿no? Cómo la gente más joven por ahí no sabe y cómo la gente más grande sí, obviamente porque lo, lo vivieron, ¿no? Pero es interesante ver ese contraste eh, también. What do you know about the Falklands? Very little. Do you know where they are? Yeah, kind of. West-ish. Um, do you know about the war? Yeah. Do you know how long ago that, that was, more or less? 80s, 90s? I don't know. I can't remember. Do you know who it was against? Either Spain or Portugal, I think. I don't know. Is that something they teach you at school or, or no, not really? Uh, no, definitely not. No. I think, we, to be honest, more, maybe didn't cover so much like modern mm -hmm. history, particularly. We went all that way, thousands of miles away, because we had to do what we felt we had to do. Mm. It cost a lot of lives on both sides. It wasn't worth. What do you remember from the time or when the war started? People knew about the Falklands. Yeah. People were worried about it. What was what was the? I don't think people knew too much about it. But don't they get this over there at Arg uh, where they were living, around Fort Stanley, or around there? It was a British way of life. There was British people living out there. It was like living in England. And uh, as far as I see it. Um, it wasn't a good idea for Argentina to invade. People know about the Falklands, where they were, why the British no, wanted no, it. really never come to people's mind until the war side. Everybody, nobody knew too much about the Falklands, only the people that was involved in it. I wish people, when they had disputes among countries, they walked the path of peace. When you look back over issue of war, you think to yourself, the damage that's been caused by war, peace is the road to walk. For the time being, I can't see how things are going to change. It's just one of those things, I'm afraid, that... Uh, but who knows what's around the corner? All well, we no. can do is feel sorry for the people that had to die. There's a, like, an ongoing dispute nowadays still, at least from Argentina. What do you think about it? I don't think I'm knowledgeable enough to express an opinion on that. I feel for the people that are out there and it's gone that way. But whether I would say the Argentinians were right... If it's not your country, you shouldn't be there. That's it, yeah. end of.
no one's got no right to be going in anywhere and, and voicing their opinions and taking over things. Nine times out of ten, it's only for profit and gain. Well, most of the time it is. It's never for the actual people. They're never over there to help you. There's yeah. always an, 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 another, another so, motive, you know? So why are you saying they, 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 the British shouldn't go there or the Argentinians shouldn't go no, there? No, the British shouldn't go there. Yeah. The British shouldn't go anywhere where they shouldn't be. They, you know, I mean, back in the day, we was the biggest... We used to take over everywhere. We're still at, we, you know what I mean, they're still at it now. And trying to do it in a slippery way, you know? Pretending that they're there to help. But no one's ever there to help. They're only there for, for money, you know, and resources. And if, they, if, they, if there's no money and no resources, then you won't find them there. So there's an, uh, an ongoing dispute still, at least from, from Argentina, about the Falklands. What do you think about it? I don't have a strong opinion. It seems to me it's up to the Falkland Islanders themselves. I mean, really, that seems to me to be the, the just thing. Whether we would again send a task force, oh, blimey, I don't know. Uh, I don't think I'd be in favour. It's a, all these things are a matter of negotiation, you know. I don't think it would affect me if the Falklands returned to Argentina. But as I say, it's a matter for the islanders, the people who live there. Y hasta ahí el video de hoy. Cerramos con el London Eye de fondo. Repito, opiniones variadas. Podemos tener suerte con la gente que nos toque, podemos tener mala suerte. Eh, no representa esto para nada, pero repito, está bueno tener una noción general de lo que sabe, lo que no sabe la gente, lo que opina o lo que no opina la gente. Espero que les haya gustado. Recuerden ir a ver el otro video que hice sobre Malvinas y lo más importante de todo, no a la guerra. La guerra siempre, 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 siempre es mala. Y eso lo quiero recalcar siempre. Odio total y repudio a la guerra. Gracias gente, a la próxima.